the Monty Hall problem. And now, maths. Here is a classic example of counterintuitive statistics. Suppose you're on a game show and you're given the choice of three doors. Behind one door is a car, behind the others, goats. You pick a door, say number one, and the host, who knows what's behind the doors, opens another door, say number three, which has a goat. He then says to you, do you want to pick door number two? Is it to your advantage to switch your choice? What do you think? You can pause the video if you really want to think it out for yourself. Most people feel that there is no advantage to switching your choice. They calculate that with two doors left, there is a one in two chance of picking the door with the car, so why change? But statistically, you are better off if you switch. Why? It's counterintuitive. But the probability of selecting the car is not one in two, but two in three if you switch. Let's work through this one step at a time. When you have no idea what is behind any door, each door has a 1 in 3 chance of having the car. When you pick door 1, you have a 1 in 3 chance of picking the car and a 2 in 3 chance of not picking the car. Now, by opening a door, say door number 3 again, we can see the goat. This has not changed the probability of the first door, but we know that door number 3 has no chance of having the car so that 2 in 3 chance is now resting all in door number 2. So you should switch to get the best chance of picking that car. Not convinced? Let's show all the possibilities again. Let's show the different possibilities for choosing door number 1. First, door 2 has the car. So when door 3 is opened, in the show the presenter will only open the door with a goat. Switching to door number 2 wins you the car. The second possibility is that door number 3 has the car. So the presenter will, in this case, open door number 2, showing our goat. So switching to door number 3 wins you the car. The final possibility, because there are no other combinations of cars and goats, is that door number 1 has the car. The presenter can either open door number 2 or 3, but in either case, switching will not win you the car. So with these three possibilities, each one equally likely, you have a 2 in 3 chance of winning the car if you switch your choice. Of course, if you want to win the goat, just stay with the first door.